Uh, Syracuse, Dino Babers. Could this be the final year of the Dino Babers experience? This is a guy I love so much when he got this job. Same here. Same here. Uh, win total sits at three and a half to go over is plus 100. So even money to go under minus 130. FBI projects them to go four and eight. SP Plus projects them to go three and nine. And honestly, I, I think even that is going to be pretty difficult. They're non conference slate. Check this out Ohio, Rutgers, Albany, Liberty. I think they lose three of those. I was just about to say there's a world where they go one and three on that. Like, I don't think that they can beat Rutgers. I don't think no. they win at Ohio. I don't think that they beat Liberty at home. Like, I, and then their conference slate is there's nobody that they are better than. Nope. There'll be a dog in all of them. I mean, it's just what happened? Absurd. What happened? All right, so we're both going under. We don't think this team is good. Let's not talk about that because there's nothing to say. What happened? This is a team that beat Clemson and then almost beat them the second time, right? So they like, had them on the ropes. Yeah, two it, years of Dino Babers looked amazing. And so it they, okay, like they were so the look, up and coming. They went five and seven in 2019. Last year was where it really like just completely just fell, fell off. Right, one and ten. Um, and the reason it fell off, like, it, they had a ton of opt-outs. They didn't get to practice forever because they're based in New York. But right, even, hang on now, even the 5-7 and seven year was a massive fall-off to what they were the two years before. Yeah. Um, That's my problem. What happened? Tommy DeVito is not who they thought he was. Like, they, they did not replace their talent Correctly. So do you think they're a quarterback away from maybe being back to special? It's, it's not just a quarterback. It is they they almost whiffed on their entire offensive line. Yeah, you can't do that. Their entire offense like these quarterbacks, you don't even know if their quarterbacks are, are actually yeah. good, right? Okay. Because they don't even have time to throw the ball. All right. That makes sense. There's no running game to speak of. Because it's the offense like, that just disappeared. Yeah, and you don't know if disappeared. the disappeared. Like you don't know if the and, and the defense, of course. Not great. No, um, no but, but they, they, they haven't ever been great. But but they're they they've always been aggressive and they've been okay. Like so long as the offense is able to score points and whatnot, they can actually keep the ball a little bit. Like they're aggressive. They are constantly blitzing. Their their entire front six is returning this year for this, and, and they've always had that confusing three three five defense, right? Yes. But even being aggressive, like they only finished number eighty three in sack rate last year. I there's just problems across the board, and it has to do with recruiting whiffs. They just miss okay. guys. So it's, it's all a talent thing. Yeah. I mean, it's a hundred percent it. Like they just don't have the dudes. So is there a world where you're you're Syracuse, you're not a superpower by any stretch? Do you just tell Dino, hey, you gotta change staff over? We trust you as a coach, but you gotta bring some guys in here that can recruit. I think he's already done it. Like he's already he's already flipped guys. So I just I, I don't know what they can do anymore. Okay. So it's um I mean, it sucks. Like, he'll be an offense coordinator somewhere, and he's going to make some noise. But yep. I think this could be it. Like, this this will be the, the final straw. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.